Good afternoon, Monday, February 21st, 2022. Want to go over uh, our uh, general market indices and also some individual stock charts. Looks like uh, could have a volatile week with the Russia news, etc. And we have oversold technometer, so I want to go over that. So let's jump in. Wyckoff wave. The technometer is down to 39.10. You can see here that over the last three weeks, we've had a new low in the uh, OP while price is holding and also testing the previous low from uh, late January. So uh, we like the way the Wyckoff wave looks here. SPY, same type of chart. You can see to the right here, we've got uh, the blue lines mark, new low in the OP, price holding higher. Green uh, circle, lower right, oversold technometer. Then our Wyckoff Wave Growth Index, that's been uh, very helpful over the years. Same type of thing, OP new lows, price holding higher, oversold technometer. Also want to show Bitcoin. We have a lot of people uh, trading the cryptos over at LearnCrypto.io. Same thing here, new low in the OP, price holding higher, and technometer right at oversold at 39.61. So let's go over some individual stock charts that look good here real quick. No specific order. They're uh, in alphabet. So we've got Apple here, one that we're long with uh, small losses. You can see here holding previous support, holding up much better than the NASDAQ. The technometer is overbought at 52.58 because it's been so strong, but this would be one that we expect to lead us higher. AMD. Had a big run uh, last year, early this year, and uh, we think just correcting it. We like the action here, 43.75. AMD, we think, will continue to be strong. American Express looks like a jump and possible backup, holding extremely well here and faces some weakness, so uh, this could lead us higher. Brookshire, BRK.B, the uh, same type of thing, technometer down near oversold. Maybe already had a jump and a backup and ready to uh, mark up. KLAC, KLAC, again, jump and a backup, ready to go. Marriott, MAR, jump and a backup. Only two days of pullback here off the high up there, 185. And uh, the green arrow shows we had a bullish divergence, oversold technometer. That support there at 159 or so looks strong. Morgan Stanley, MS, one that had been strong, did come under pressure last week. We're going to watch this. We have an oversold technometer. Uh, going back to August, we have new lows in the OP while price is sideways. So uh, we do think this one uh, could be interesting. We'll watch this early in the week. Microsoft has been in a strong uptrend, having a little pullback. We think testing the lows there a month ago. We still think Microsoft, like Apple, will lead us higher. SBNY, a uh, bank involved in crypto, extremely strong chart, even in the face of Bitcoin being a little bit weak. This one looks like continued higher. Schwab, the uh, discount broker, same type of thing, had a jump and a backup. Looks like a nice sideways correction here. New lows OP, price holding higher, oversold technometer. So Schwab could lead us higher as well. I do think. Uh, Stocks will head higher. There'll be more people coming into trading and will be good for the brokerage firms. SI Silvergate uh, looks a little bit more like a Bitcoin chart. Again, uh, not the strongest chart, but we think is an accumulation and we think uh, could be purchased here and will work higher. And uh, last but not least, Victoria's Secret, VSCO, a jump and a backup. And... Uh, Again, one that we think that could perform, well, could perform well moving forward. So just a quick update on uh, what we're looking for here. And uh, stay tuned for early in the week. Let's see what the news is from Russia. And uh, look for uh, markets to make a low. And some of the stocks we just showed you possibly lead us higher. Good trading.